hello everyone hope you all are doing well so today i am going to show you how you can make khatai with oven and without oven so the ingredients that you need are uh, take a one and a half cup of maida flour all purpose flour that is 200 grams one cup of sugar that is 100 grams one cup of ghee 130 grams 1 teaspoon baking soda or baking powder 6 tablespoons of besan 60 grams it is flour made of cereal grains 1 teaspoon of cardamom powder and some almonds and we need one egg also First of all, mix all the dry ingredients in all-purpose flour, baking powder, sugar, icing sugar basically, basin and cardamom powder also. Mix them well with a spoon. Now add uh, ghee or clarified butter in it and uh, uh, make a soft dough. Uh, wash your hands and mix this dough with your hands. Mix it till it is fully incorporated with uh, other dry ingredients. It can be mixed with hands well. I have mixed it well and it has become a soft batter like this. Uh, now start making biscuits out of it. And uh, remember one thing that don't make too big or thick biscuits. Um, make them small and thin so that they can bake easily. Uh, give them a shape like this you can uh, make shape any shape uh, you can uh, give it circle shape or you can give it a square shape as well I have made all the biscuits one tray will go in oven and the other will be baked on stove now take an egg and coat all the biscuits with it with a brush coat all the biscuits like that now I have taken some almonds and cut them inside now one by one put almonds on the biscuits and uh, gently press them inside you can use other dry fruits as well you can use cashew you can also use pistachio it's all up to your choice now the biscuits are absolutely ready to be baked. I have preheated oven for 15 minutes. Now uh, leave them for 25 to 30 minutes in oven on 160 degrees. Now preheat a cooking pot for 15 minutes on medium flame. When it is preheated, place a stand in it now place tray in it and uh, bake them uh, for 40 to 45 minutes on low to medium flame our oven khatai are absolutely ready now let me check their condition in cooking pot they are perfectly rising 40 minutes have passed and you can see that they have taken a very beautiful brown color Don't turn the flame too high because it will definitely give brown color to the biscuits but it will burn the base of the biscuits. Now our khatayya are ready. Remember to take the biscuits out of the tray after 10 to 15 minutes. Our khatayya are ready. These are ready. You can take them with evening tea. Put them in an airtight jar or a box and they will go for one week. 
if you like the recipe do tell me in comment box and if you have any problem with that you can ask me any questions feel free to ask me questions in comment box try this recipe at home and you will definitely like it waiting for your feedback thanks to watch my video